Um, did you not even write any shitting bits for the new movie? Yeah, I did. I wrote one that I really wanted to do, too. I have a swing with a the toilet seat, and then and you know that trick you do on a swing where you swing as high as you can, and then you do a flip out of it? Mm -hmm. And at the height of my flip, I was going to shit upside down. <laughs> That's epic. Yeah, and it's simple, you know? And they, you think that we could, oh, yeah, we'll just shoot that real quick. It won't take very much, but they never did it. Damn. I wrote some other ones, too. That was the one I really wanted, though. But, yeah, mm -hmm. I wrote some, and just didn't happen. I mean, we... I don't know. We had so few filming days for this one compared to any of the other ones. It was like 30 days of filming all yeah, told. Yeah, and no travel. All yeah. in and around L.A. only. So there are a lot of ideas that didn't happen. Yeah, seriously. <laughs> right, especially ones that you were like planning to do. Was there a trip that was planned, or like international nah, they trip? Were never gonna. They were never going to travel. Even for before this one, COVID, right? that's because know. of COVID. Yeah, he had few. But days. I'm saying, like, even when they're when you're writing the movie before COVID hit, there was no like, and then we'll go fly to India. Jeff for a while. told me he said if you if you guys want to go somewhere, write enough ideas that are good to make us want to take you there. Yeah. So I would always, always said that. Yeah, I've always tried. You know, I want to go somewhere. I'm like, yeah. I write a bunch of New Zealand ideas. Uh huh. Or, uh huh. You know, but <clears throat> um, you uh. That was it? That just the one swing shit idea? No, I had a bunch of ideas, but I'm not just going to blur them all out uh, here for everybody. Uh, okay. I just feel like that one's a goner now. <laughs> but yeah, I, I wrote some, time. and I don't know if they just didn't want to shit in this movie. They got press and shit in the movie. Um, yeah. Accidentally. Man, that stunk. I was like 100 yards away. I was so far away. I'm like, what is that smell? Like, oh, like, and they're like, press and shit in his pants. I was nowhere near and I could smell it. Wow. Somebody said, uh... God, Preston had been so bummed about like that happening. I'm like, what? About no. getting that epic gold footage. Yeah, I'm like, I'm like, dude, like he was about to do some dirty dancing thing where like he could get hurt, and, right? Like, and he didn't have to get hurt. He got the footage. Like, he's stoked. For sure, it's a hilarious part of the movie. Yeah. But you think he was about to get hurt? I mean, whatever. Like, if it like it. I it, bet Wee Man was, was yeah, really right because Wee Man, Wee Man was, yeah, was able I don't to think catch he was, him. Like got out of any pain. <laughs> right. He just and we were nowhere near any place to clean up though either. That's another problem. I don't know how he got that all cleaned up, but yeah, it's called Stevo's Hot Sauce for Your Butthole. And if you go on Amazon and type in Stevo's Hot Sauce for Your Butthole and order yourself a bottle, you'd be really helping me because right now we're ranked number thirty on all of Amazon. And if you buy a bottle. We might go up the ladder, and that would mean a lot. So please get on Amazon and buy Stevo's hot sauce for your butthole. Yeah. Yeah, dude.